Hi students. So today in our lecture video we will have an examples related to polynomial and zeros of polynomial how it is diagrammatically solved okay so let us take first example consider the curve along x and y axis and the curve looks like this okay has i already stated if y is equal to p of x that's our polynomial then the curve cuts or touches or intersects the x axis is called the zeros of polynomial right so now you can see this we have a curve which touches the x axis only at one point so we have one zeros of polynomial now let us take one more example so second one consider the x and y axis right so you have a curve of this form it's an parabolic curve okay here you can see two points are touching the x axis so in this case we have two zeros of polynomial right so let us consider the third example so consider an x and y axis right and you have a curve of this form right so in this case you can clearly see this is the first point which meets the x axis this is the second point and this will be the third point so here the totally we have three zeros of polynomial right similar to this we'll take one two examples so the fourth one so i have a curve of this form a straight line okay so you can see this even though it touches the y axis we are worried only about the point touching at x axis so it's a 1 zero of polynomial right so let us take another two examples so fifth one again x and y axis we have right and we have a curve which touches the x axis in this form so it's like parabolic curve again and you can see this is the only point which is touching the x axis so it's again 1 0 of polynomial so the last problem we'll see sixth question so you have a curve of this form
so in this curve we have point number 1 2 so we have three zeros of polynomial so this is all about the graphical representation of learning a polynomial related to zero of polynomial hope you understand meet you in the next video thank you